What's up YouTube? It's your boy Pretty Boy Forbes and I'm back with another reaction video. Today I'm about to react to the new performance by Justin Bieber, Thames and Wizkid at Coachella 2024. If you're new to this reaction channel, feel free to subscribe, like the video and turn on post notifications for all of my latest updates. So without further ado, let's start the reaction. Wow, Wizkid is shorter than, than Tim's, bro. Like, I didn't know Tim's was that tall, man. She's a tall drink of water, and I love it, man. So far, her vocal delivery is really subtle. She's not really expressing herself that much, but I can hear that she, she's got the talent to perform live, man. And I'm liking her energy and how the crowd is reacting to it. You know, crowd engagement is important as a live performer. And you know, Wizkid and she's probably hadn't seen each other in a while. So I'm really interested in seeing their chemistry on stage. But so far, so good. Let's continue. Wow, the energy of the show, man, I can feel it, I'm not even there. You can you can feel that, you know, Tim, she's engaging with the crowd and she's just living through the song, man. And she she means everything that she's saying. And she says she don't need no need no other body. And it's taking me back to when the song was first released, man. And I can just, you know, I can know that she really took her time and effort into making the song. That's why it was such a smash hit. You know, the chemistry with Wiz Kid is just phenomenal, man. And the live band, the orchestra, the people that's playing behind the scenes, it's fire too. So far, I'm loving this performance. I'm liking the quality and I'm liking the effort put into it. So let's continue. I want to see what Bieber does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only you feel my body. You don't need no other body. You mess up your mind. And I mean, they make you free up your mind. See your body talks to me nice. Say, I'm a love you, they need for your life. Say, I want love, no be love. Say, yeah, you get together, yeah, day or night. Yeah, you believe I go by, yeah, you believe I'm stroking your body, baby, rocking your body, baby, as you're winding your body. Baby. Okay, let's let's talk about something right now. Whiz kid is not it, man. Like his delivery, the way he sounds, his voice, he's not keeping the right tone. He's not delivering it properly. And his energy just dropped immediately when he came in, man. And he's running out of breath. Like, he didn't prepare for this shit, man. And you can see that the crowd, they're not enjoying Wizkid right now. And so far, he's really damaging the performance. Because you can see already that his delivery, the way he's singing, what he's saying, I don't believe it, bro. He's not believable as a performer. And I can honestly say... Wiz Kid could have been better, but let's see where it goes. Nah, Wiz Kid was horrible, man. I couldn't even hear a word that he said. His equipment was faulty. His delivery was faulty. His energy was awkward, man. That's, that's the thing. When it comes to being a performer, it's not something that you can learn. It has to come from a natural place. And you really got to enjoy and love performing, man. And obviously, Tim, he's a superstar when it comes to performances. But so far, Wiz Kid was really disappointing. But let's see what happened. <laughs> Woo! 
Oh shit! Ah, oh, the cross is joining this shit, bro. Ooh. Ooh, shit. Let's talk about the performance, man. Obviously, when Justin came in, the crowd's energy just changed immediately. You know, he has that presence where he can just make everybody feel alive with his stage presence. He's that powerful. His vocal delivery was a bit shaky, but it was bearable and it was actually good. With that being said, the overall performance was fire. I liked the engagement. I liked how... They, they, the chemistry was so on point and they really had this this familiarity with each other like they've been friends for years man and i enjoy that to see that when artists are this close and this compatible when performing with whisk kid he was let down in the performance but i can excuse him man he i know he was a bit nervous probably not his it's probably his first time performing at coachella so he, he was probably a little bit nervous and obviously you can see that his nerves got to him with his performance but other than that the performance was quite phenomenal and i like that bieber showed himself and it showed that he's still alive because you know he doesn't really perform as much so i really loved the performance it was really enjoyable F apart from a few bad stuff that happened it was really good for that reason i gotta rate this performance a 8 out of 10 wait wait make it a 7 out of 10 whiskey was a bit bad so we gotta be a 7 out of 10 it's definitely a pass but i feel if whiskey stepped up his game this would have been a 10 man with that being said thank you for watching if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe like the video and turn on post notifications for all of my latest updates I'm out.